Hello guys, Kitty here. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can make this super small 12 volt 1 amp SMPS. So let's start the video. So guys, first let's make the PCB. So this is the copper clad board and this is the bottom layer. So clean this and put uh, use iron and press for 5 minutes. And I've also made a video on how to make PCB. Link is in the video description. So guys, after five minutes, our bottom layer is printed. So now, uh, put this in uh, ferric chloride and then uh, shake it for uh, 20 minutes. So now our PCB is fully edged. So now let's print the uh, top seat layer. So again, uh, press it with iron for five minutes. So I've printed the top seal clear so now you need to uh, clean its bottom layer guys after cleaning the bottom layer we need to drill the hole so for that i am using a, a 0.8 millimeter drill bit so let's drill so i have drilled all the holes as you can see so now let's mount all the components guys i put all the components so now let's solder them i've soldered all the components so now let's find the transformer so this is a ee19 transformer with an air gap as you can see so first let's find the primary so guys for the primary i am using a 0.1 mm copper wire from an old mini transformer so uh, this is the starting point so wind 196 tons uh, like this so guys i have completed 196 tons so now uh, insulate this winding using this type of PVC tape let's find the secondary so for secondary I am using 0.4 mm wire so wind 24 tons for 12 volt like this I have winded 24 tons so now insulate this winding also let's find the auxiliary winding so this is the starting point this one so wind 24 tons in this direction so guys our transformer is now ready so now let's put this in the pcb and solder it so now our circuit is ready now we need to put this AP8022 IC so now let's power the circuit as you can see the output LED is on and the output voltage is 13.6 volts so it means our circuit is properly working so now let's uh, try it with a load so guys this is my setup uh, this meter will show the output voltage and this will show the output current and this is my uh, 150 watt electronic load so now let's turn on the circuit as you can see the output voltage is 13.5 uh, so now let's slowly increase the current Guys, as you can see at around 1 amps of current the output voltage is 13.3 and the circuit does not produces any sound it means our 
SMPS is working properly. So guys, this was my today's video. And if you like this video, please like, subscribe and share with your friends. And if you have any question regarding this SMPS, then you can ask me in the comment section. So thanks for watching.